Hello sweet friends, today is Friday and I am at Starbucks right now because it's Friday. Like, it's been a long week you guys. Um, and so today I'm going to be taking you guys along throughout my day and so I'm pretty much in the planning stage right now. And so basically this is going to be a plan with me vlog. Um, I'm planning for the first week of school obviously but I'm also planning for meet the teacher and also my conferences that I have. Um, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I just shared in my stories kind of like where I've been, what I've been up to, how I've been feeling, and kind of just like the more vulnerable real life of how it's like being a first year teacher. And so if you don't follow me there, you should because I share a lot of like updates and stuff like that that I don't share on here. Um, hold on, I need to order. <laughs> Anyways, so today's gonna be like a plan with me kind of vlog and I'm just gonna take you through planning for the first week and all of that fun stuff And so I'm excited to be vlogging again you guys like I feel like the last two weeks just with professional developments I have been so crazy busy and there's hasn't really been anything for me to vlog because obviously I can't vlog like the professional developments and so I'm so excited to be back and to be able to vlog and chat with you guys and share and all of that fun stuff so Yeah so I'm gonna get my coffee and head to my school and I will see you there. Hello friends, I'm at school now obviously and so what I'm doing right now is I'm gonna have to call all my parents that haven't signed up for conferences yet to sign up and so uh, this is the first time talking to some of my parents which is super exciting and so I just printed off a list of all my parents phone numbers and their kids names and all that information and then I'm just gonna cross them off as I go as I call them and I'm gonna have blooms open so that then they can uh, just tell me verbally what time they want and then I will just sign them up so that then I can get everyone signed up and so oh I'm not sure if I've talked about this so in Washington State in kindergarten we are required to meet with all families before school actually starts and so from September 4th through 6th which is actually my birthday um, I'm going to be in conferences with my families before school starts on the 9th and so I have to get all my parents signed up and so I have I think like five families already signed up and so I have some to call <laughs> and so I'm gonna call them and introduce myself and get them signed up for conferences and so this is gonna be exciting start talking to some of my families ah also just a side note this is so good and so it's the grande pumpkin caramel cold brew so good definitely recommend way better than the pumpkin spice lattes in my opinion but Yes, so this makes me very happy and I'm so excited to talk to my families. Okay, I'm gonna talk to them and then I will check in with you guys afterwards. All right, you guys, so I finished calling my parents a while ago, got probably 75% of my family signed up for conferences, so that's good. And then I left messages for the ones that weren't able to pick up. And right now I'm working on my math rotations binder. So I was watching Naturally Elementary's video last night because I was bored and I love the resource that she had to do her math rotations. And so I actually ended up grabbing it. And so this is just what the um, file comes with. So I printed off the quick assessments and then I also, so I just put it in this binder. I printed off um, this week at a glance, and so then you can plan um, each of the stations um, just for a week. And then I printed off the small group plans, and so this will be um, what I use every day for m when I'm working with my students. And so on the rotations, there's a meet with the teacher station, and so then I will be using this plan to plan for that and then I also printed off the quick assessments and so if I need to assess like a certain skill I can do that really quickly with all my students here and then just like check off if they can do it or add notes or whatever and so I just kind of prepped this so that this is ready um, and then obviously I'll have to prep the different activities and so that's kind of what I'm working on um, what else have I done that's basically it so far Calling parents took me like a really long time, like over an hour. <laughs> and so I am going to start looking for some resources for our math centers, just ones so that I can have them prepped and ready to go at the beginning of the year so that then I can just pull from there. And so I think I'm going to be using these Michael's carts, um, these little bins to organize my um, centers the ones that will at least fit and so I think I'll do one for math and one for reading and that will give me a really good start for the beginning of the year and so 
yeah that's kind of what i'm working on and then i just laid these out on all my students desks i haven't filled them out obviously because we're still adding kids to our list but i'm gonna have them have this piece of paper for their when they come for meet the teacher so then they can remember their family connection meeting and so that's also what i did but i don't remember what the classroom looked like the last time that i saw you guys um I'm trying to think what's new, but my classroom is basically set up like it's already. I just need to like prep now, which is why I'm filming to prep with me, obviously. And also I'm kind of whispering because there are other teachers in the building today and I don't really want them to come in and see. All right, you guys, I am just trying to like organize all of the paper things that I've been given the past couple of weeks like schedules and stuff and so I have a whiteboard right here that I like put them up there but the thing is look at this giant file you guys this is just one of four drawers that just have like obviously I can close it a ton of resources but like oh my goodness I just I don't know you guys <laughs> this is a little bit overwhelming i just it's gonna take a really long time for me to go through all of these files and figure out what exactly i want to keep what i might use oh my goodness like look at this this is just like a disaster so i'm just gonna start going through these see if there's anything that's my style that i want to keep everything else i'm gonna get rid of because paper clutter you guys no thank you <laughs> but i'm gonna check this out and see what's in here the giant file cabinet and I just kept the things that I think I might use and honestly I just need like a fresh start you know like this is my very first year I'm gonna accumulate my own resources and so I just kept the ones that I think I might actually use and got rid of the ones that I don't think I'm going to use because all teachers have their different styles right and so some of the things in there just weren't my cup of tea and so I cleared it out and so I'm going to show you the drawers now. I just feel so much lighter and better, you guys. So this is this drawer. So there's still some stuff in here that I thought would be good. And then I kept quite a bit of this one just because there was some good resources for all the letters and stuff. And I feel like you can never have enough of this stuff, like too much of this stuff. And so I kept some of that stuff. This thing is like so finicky. And then I really cleared out this one as well. And then 
this one is completely empty now. So I feel a lot better now just having that done. And so I just need to like clean up all the mess that I have made now. Um, just so that then it'll be clean for when I come back. Um, I'm not sure if I talked about it on here. I mean, but basically, let me set you up. Okay, so basically, today is Friday, and um, on Tuesday, we have meet the teacher in the morning, and then Wednesday, we start conferences, Wednesday through Friday. And so, school is starting really soon, you guys, and it's crazy. <laughs> and so, tomorrow, I'm not going to be able to come in because we are going to a wedding, and so we're going to be out of town, and then I'm pretty sure I'm going to be here all Sunday and all Monday just getting ready because... I am not ready <laughs> and so that is probably what the plan is but I'm really glad that I cleared out that file cabinet just because it was stressing me out and it was such a huge job to get rid of everything and just go through everything and choose what I wanted to keep and so I'm really glad that that is done and I'm glad that almost all my kids are signed up for conferences and so that's another thing off my to-do list and now I just need to like create a like meet the teacher and contact card to give to my students when they come and just little things like that and then i really need to start planning the first day i've like planned some stuff like i know what we're gonna do for morning work i know what craft we're gonna do i know you know what procedures we have to go through i just have to like really solidify what procedures we're gonna do and like make visuals for them and then just finish up little things like um, I need to make a graphic for their home folder, I need to label their names everywhere, <laughs> and stuff like that. And so, it's just crazy, you guys. Like, I, like, am feeling kind of overwhelmed, but at the same time, like, not that much, you know? Like, I think I feel relieved from cleaning out that cabinet, honestly. I just am a very, I don't like clutter, and so I just needed to do it. So, I'm going to finish up here for today. I have no idea how long this vlog is, you guys. <laughs> it's been, like, a busy day, but, like, I feel like I didn't get that much done, if that makes sense. Like, it was just, like, jobs that took a really long time. And so, I'm going to start cleaning up, and I will show you guys... Did I show you my room already? I think I did, and so I won't show you again. But, um, I'm going to clean up, and then I'll show you my office area, because you guys are super interested in that, and so... I'm gonna clean up and then I will show you. Alright, so this is what my office space is looking like. I haven't really worked on it that much. I ordered a like whiteboard, um, cork board thing for over here that will be coming hopefully today. But basically I just organized this cart. So like I have, I'm gonna put all like, just make a bunch, a bunch of copies of all of my students' names on like a checklist and just have them in here. Then I have like our para schedules and the map of the building, time sheets volunteer information, incident reports, financial stuff, referrals, miscellaneous, and then first aid. And so I just kind of organized that stuff and then I just have some other teachery things up here. I have my toolbox and my CT made me this little pencil that says my name which is super cute. I just have black pens and then like felt pens. Um, these are papers that I'm gonna have to put up soon. Up here, I just have my like read aloud books that I want to save for me to read before I put them in my library. Astrobytes, laminate, and then all my curriculum books, you guys. Like, not even kidding, this is just half of the year. <laughs> um, and then I have my math workshop binder that I showed you today. Some other journals. I'm going to organize this a little bit better later. Um, my monitor. And yeah. I have like two file things under here. One of these is going to be for student files and then the other one is going to be for like monthly things like newsletters and reading logs and stuff like that that I can just store there. And here I just have like some PD books, a wobble seat because I don't know which student is going to need that best yet. Um, and then those are all storage bags like Ziploc bags. Um, I just have some Lysol wipes, and then these are like extra supplies, so like extra crayons, extra pencils, my laminator, and just stuff like that, and so things that I don't need access to all the time. So, yeah. 
and my room as I said is like pretty much figured out put together it's just kind of you know more into the curriculum now and planning I'm not sure if I showed you guys this but I made this little tub of files for me to organize my copies for the week and so I just have different labels for um, the different things that I might need during the week and so this I think will just be really easy for me to organize all my copies in one place and then if I ever have a sub they can just go and grab it and so yeah okay you guys this is where I'm going to end today's vlog I know I think it was probably on the shorter side but this is honestly just like real life of prepping for the beginning of the school year it's kind of crazy it's not a lot of fun things it's a lot of tasks that take a really long time and so yeah and so i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video if you did please make sure to give it a thumbs up make sure to hit that subscribe button i'm a first year kindergarten teacher and i'm going to document my whole journey make sure you follow me on instagram for more candid in the moment kind of day-to-day -day life and i will see you guys in my next video bye